Hi, Sartash. What's up? Hey, welcome back to our Stupid Reactions. It is, I'm Corbin. I am Rick. And you can follow me on Instagram, Instagram and Twitter for more juicy content. That's so content is juice. juice. So some Patreon will follow an official Twitter account. Today, a uh, new trailer dropped, I believe this morning, I believe it was. Uh, it is called... Is that what woke me up? Yes. Uh, Tan Haji. Tan Haji? Sure. The unsung warrior. Well, if I sing about him now, he's not unsung. <laughs> see what I... Is that how you pronounce that name? Because I'm sure it's like a It's story. close enough that it's not Corbinized, so yeah. you suck. Well, it could be a name, so. Uh, but yes, this is Saif Ali Khan, another film from him. Uh, can I, I hope we get to see this one. <laughs> well, it's T-Series, so probably. Um, so. You think there'll be any uh, Captain Jack Sparrow references in this one? Yeah! yeah! <laughs> I sure hope so. <laughs> Here we go. based on the true events? I, I, I can't imagine this isn't based on everything they were talking about. Yeah. This has like got some, to be based on a true story. Well-known surgical strike is what yeah. it said of uh, epic proportions is what it looks like. And I'm also of the opinion that Maratha is Marathi? related to Marathi. Mm. That's, I would assume. We could be totally, totally wrong. We could be totally, totally wrong. And probably we are. We are learning. Uh, we are usually mm. wrong. Yep. Um, <laughs> but my opinions are facts, so. Uh, the uh, the first thing that stuck out to me was one the music. The music. I, it's T series though. It's T series. They're yeah. so good at making music, which is why they copyright 
everything. <laughs> I get it. It's your music, whatever. But they have really good music. Yeah. Uh, and this it looks like it's no exception. Uh, this, I know you hate it when you compare stuff to 300, but the style of it. can't. Uh, there was one shot that was a straight out copy. Straight out copy. Trigger warning. Sorry, um, but when when for, for those of you who get upset about that and say not everything we're doing is a copy of 300, I'm just going to point out something to y'all. Any motion picture that's made after the film 300 was made, irrespective of the subject matter, that has imagery in it that is a duplicate of 300 is copying 300. Just saying. Just like any gangster film after Godfather. Exactly. Is basically trying and to be there's, I don't know, I don't remember who it was that was doing it, but that one moment where he jumps up to grab onto the rock and it moves into slow motion and he hangs onto the rock, that is exactly the same shot of Leonidas jumping up to go talk to the, um, I forgot their names, yeah. the old men that are there. But with the, also the, the style of it, like the style of the um, CGI. Not in its totality. It. No, obviously not it's all. a completely different story. Not at all. And we're not saying this whole film is going to be that. There were just definitely some things, and it very well could be. It's absolutely beautifully complimentary if the director and the cinematographer were inspired by Zack Snyder and wanted to do things that were shout-outs to them. You know what does upset me, though? It, nothing, nothing to do with this. It's... I feel like Saif Ali Khan would have been a fantastic Jafar. 100%. So many things upset me. I haven't seen Don't, the new Aladdin. Don't, let's not even... Yeah. I haven't seen the new Aladdin, but it, just, right. it upset me that they didn't let Indian cinema do it. It should have just been handed over. Like, because Ranveer would have been an amazing uh, Aladdin. I, Saif Ali Khan could have played a really good Jafar. Anyways, sorry. Off we can keep going. There. We can keep going down the list. But him looking there, I was like, he looks really... He could have been a really good Jafar. Anyways, but we, I, could, I, we could go down. That would be a fun thing to do sometime. About what we, like we did do. for the Joker. Yeah, yeah. Who, who we would choose for each of the roles and each of the people for the... the and yes, I know Bollywood has done Aladdin before. We're talking about Disney's version. Disney's version. Yeah. Anyways. Anyway. Uh, but yeah, the, I think Saif Ali Khan looked really good. I'm glad he's branching out because, you know, the cocktail song we did? Yeah. Uh, that was the role he was put in, is what I've been told. Like, he right. was put in that role for years long, and years, and that's who he was. Right. And since Sacred Games, basically, he started to being able to explore a little which bit. Which is great. Uh, which is good, because he's a, he's a good actor. Yeah. He's not a, he's not Nawaz, but, you know, I think he knows that. And I, uh, few are. Yeah, but, you know, he's trying to be... He's very, very good. Yeah. I like um, him a lot. And uh, obviously that other actor's a really good actor. Yeah. <laughs> we, that, what's his name? I, I always forget his name. But, uh, uh, um, um, do you remember it? Yeah, from... Uh, oh, gone it. Uh, the, the movie that we saw. Yeah, that wasn't the original... Trishim. Trishim, yeah. yes. What's his name? Uh, v v v v v hurry, hurry, Rick. I'm about to find it. V a v a AJ. AJ. I, I don't know how you, if that's how you pronounce that. Yes. I think it's AJ. 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 Not AJ. I don't know. That would be a very white way to say it, probably. AJ. AJ Devgan. That would be Corbinized. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> yeah, but this looks really interesting. Let us know more about the uh, the actual story of this, uh, please. Yeah, uh, and and now now that we said what we did about the visual impersonation on a couple of things, and hopefully you've held on and didn't just shut off the the reaction. If all this was was that, I would have no interest in seeing it because I've seen three hundred. I don't need to see duplications. I don't think this film is that in its totality. I think it has some shout outs that very well could be simply a tip of the cap to Zack Snyder and the visual stunnery which, if are, I can use which that is word. fine which is great here read this on um, but would you turn it I'm not going to touch it with my filthy monkey hands thank you it is based on the life of Tanaji is that right Malasari a 17th century mm, Maharashtrian Marathi military leader that's awesome so it is yeah the fact that this would be that means a lot and hopefully it does it's going to take artistic license and be poetic and beautiful yeah. i'm actually i really really hope they release this in theaters because this looks like it's one of those that you want to see on the big screen yeah of course That's and it. is the uh when they were sliding through the mountain basically on a zip line is that an actual thing because yeah. we know like a lot of the stuff we see like the camel cannons right. and, and the weapons that we're like oh it's that's a weird weapon yeah. but it's based in 
fact of uh, old Indian um, military right. style, basically. Right. Like is that the, something like the they, camel cannons? Is and... that like something they used to do? That'd be awesome. Right. That would be awesome. That, that's uh, that's fantastic. I would like to know that the the historical accuracy of that. I would also like to know: Is there a Marathi film that tells the story of this military leader? That would be intriguing to me. And if there's been other films made in any of the industries in India about this story, so I'm. I'm very, very interested. Yeah, wanna... Anything Saif Ali Khan does, I, I'm, I really want to see. I really yeah. like him a lot. Yeah. <laughs> Sartaj. Yeah, it's Sartaj, man. I really like him a lot. Yeah. 